Hi Fireside, welcome to my channel. We're doing your daily love soulmate relationship for Tuesday. This is for the 10th, October. Okay, let's see what's going on with you guys. As you, everyone knows, I've started doing the Gypsy Oracle. So we'll see what's going on with the tarot. And in our extended read, we're going to go dive deeper into it and also the guides for whatever that you have been, you know, um, going through. This is your daily love soulmate relationship. Aries, Leo, and Sagittarian. Okay. Sun, Moon, and Rising. So let's see what's going on for you guys. Tuesday. Let's see here. This is you. Either or situation. Ten of Pentacles. Something is re reaching its completion. Okay. This is when you know that things are going well. You're with someone right now and you just know that it's, ju it's just going well unexplainable um, because there's something materializing now something is being shared let me see here you have here the ten of wands a lot of things are putting into final you know final stretch this is the final stretch ten of wands receiving everything remember this is the harvest card sometimes of course this is the oppression the tired you know but this is about you know like this person is getting what they have worked hard for if you're working hard for a connection, can be with an earth sign, this is it. This is the moment, okay, that things are being put together stronger and stronger. You know, foundation, um, all the hard work that you have put in, your creative, you know, your creative energy has manifested something that is solid. It goes through the generation. It even brings you good, you know, good financial um, structure over here. You could be working with someone, okay, that you're thinking of doing business together. Like your partner is someone so ideal, well, not so ideal, but you know, like you feel that, you know what, I, I would want to have a business with my partner. I would want to be with this person, you know, like maybe there's future between me and this person, okay, in the same company or in the same work or in the same business. That's what I'm sensing here. Good energy. See here, fire sign. Knight of Swords. You guys are talking straightly, you know, um, movement is, there's no turning back anymore with this kind of completion also. No turning back. It's all movement now. You know, things are being addressed over here. And sorry, because I don't do that. Okay. I just don't want it to be flipped. So things are um, coming to terms. Things are being addressed. Issues are being, okay. Issues are being, okay being discussed this is all again spinning under the knight of swords and you have here the tower this is the big ending the final stretch all walls nothing nothing can be you know built until this thing has been finished and if you're connecting with a person who has blockages which is can be the ten of ones that's their blockage it has crumbled down already that is the energy where bam that's a tower right there and the wheel of fortune is like bam all right that's the wheel of fortune right there so what goes down must come up okay that's the energy that i'm sensing here because it's completion so a whole cycle seven of wands over here with a ten of pentacles a person now is not gonna entertain anybody nobody can come towards this kind of connection it's stable i'm not gonna entertain anyone anymore you can knock at my door, but this door is shut. I don't have any intention of entertaining anybody. Now, let me see um, just the arc. I mean, I'm, not, I'm just curious. I don't even care. I mean, but the Knight of Swords over here. Let me see. What is the energy of the Knight of Swords over here? Let me see. For Tuesday, energy of the Knight of Swords. can be an air sign over here. I see Scorpio, Aries, Piscean, Sagittarian. Okay. These are just energies I'm sensing over here but this knight of sort of straightforward energy of communication what is it about a lord over here a person who okay who is not scared high vibration over here this person can appear to be a businessman or established with regards to their career especially with the wheel of fortune underneath it this person has has been so um how to call that has been um a hard-working person that things come up to fruition with regards to their finances and now if finances are good normally relationship comes next so let me that's why is this flying i'm gonna get the energy of the tower sorry about that okay so let me see here the energy of the tower the whole crumbling down let me see the energy of the tower 
Oh, something flipped. We have here a friend. Can be someone who is a friend before, is now a lover. Okay? Now, I'm gonna say, it's like, oh, you, you sugarcoat this. Okay? If I cover the cards, would you even know what it is? Right? So no. <laughs> Okay, so it, this is a big shift. Someone sees you as a friend before, now it's different. Let me see here, next to the friend. A foe, okay? Look at that, friend or foe. So it has been identified now. Are you a friend or a foe? That is, that, that, that is what is coming to fruition now. More clarity, things are being discussed by people around you. You have been influenced by other people also. You've talked to other people, discussed them. It's like, oh, this person is not good for you. But, you know, that's what they're telling you also. You know, this person appears to be either you have met at work, something with regards in, at their work, or they're a business person. And this has been discussed with other people that, because they were scared for you. Other people were scared for this. But this person has been remaining faithful towards you. And that makes you confident with the connection, regardless of the other influences. You stop listening to other people also. That's what I'm sensing here. That's a tower. You stop listening to other people's influence on who this person is. Because some people were judging you on who the, on who's good for you. can be a family, a friend, okay, that was going against this person. But this person has remained faithful. And now it's moving forward. They didn't like that this person was very blunt to you. They didn't like that. You have texted your friend, screen capture, Snapchat, all those stuff to your friend, family, and they didn't like how they talked to you. But you know that this person is someone that you would want to be with, and then now it's coming to you. All right, fire sign. I'm going to continue this reading with how it, how it pans out and more of the situation um, and guidance. Have a wonderful, wonderful Tuesday. Bye.